Hey everyone, welcome to another edition of Saltwater Fishing Tampa. My name is Scott. Today we're at the Skyway Bridge. It's Labor Day weekend. It's a Saturday. I was out here yesterday and just nailed the mangroves out here. Just nailed them. And so we're out here and we're going to try and do another repeat today. So anyways, we got the, uh, the Skyway facing north that way. You got the golf. A little bit choppy out here today. It said it wasn't going to be that choppy, but it really is. I'm out here at the last bollard. I did really well here yesterday. So, and uh, you know, there were dolphins out here yesterday, and and hopefully we can get a bunch of boaters out here to distribute the dolphins between them. Because when you're the only boat out here, boy, I tell you, they really come after you. So, uh, anyways, you can see it. There's a lot of boats heading out this way, but you can see the waves out here. Said it was supposed to be smooth. It'll probably smooth out today, and uh, maybe I can get a uh, cast for some. Uh, glass minnows my wife really wants me to get a, a net full and uh, a couple of one gallon ziplock bags full of but uh, anyways uh, we're gonna try for some mangrove snapper here and uh, I got a bunch of cut bait I cut it up earlier right there those are up uh, those are sardines and uh, got a bunch of lively greenbacks here let's see what we got look at these guys <laughs> that's perfect bait right there nice size too and uh, what we're going to be doing is using, well, get in there, guy. I'm going to be using my yellowtail snapper jigs right here. Now I got my uh, twin power, 30-pound uh, power pro, and uh, using the little little snapper jig on that right there. That's all I'm going to be using with about a uh, five, six-foot leader and just tossing it right out there. That's our strategy for today. I'm going to be chumming up with that, uh, with the uh, sardines. I like the sardines because I said they sink fast so I'm gonna throw one in there and just see which way it's gonna go see how fast they sink yep going straight down now the tide's supposed to change around noon but um, it said it was supposed to change at 6 this morning and then um, uh, then it'll be going in all day until noon it'll be coming out but uh, we'll see it's kind of windy that's our strategy for today and <laughs> we're gonna see what we're gonna get so uh, Anyways, that's the strategy for this morning, and uh, now let's catch some fish. Well, I'm going to get me some greenbacks out of here. Live little guys, find a nice one. Put them on here just like this. Just, just like that. Hook them just through that. And you can see the size of them right there. See that? He's about two and a half inches long and uh, about a five-foot leader. And just um, tossing them out here. So... Let me just toss them out. Well, I'm gonna toss them out there just like that. Hopefully that dolphin won't come around, but there'll be enough boats out today. I'll move around these bollards to get the dolphin out of the way, but uh, let's see what we can do. I can feel that green back on the end there. These mangroves hit, they hit hard and fast. No, I gotta put my pinger in. There's my pinger. Okay, let's get that guy in there. So there you go. I put a new C-sized battery in it, so uh, we should be good. Right there is the pinger. Come on, fish. Come on. Fish on! It's a mangrove! And that, I saw the dolphin going away, but there you go. First mangrove of the day right there. Look at that. And I tell you, he's a small guy, but uh, let's just measure him up anyway. Look at that, got him on that jig, see that? Man, he just, he just, I just threw it in there. It didn't even hit bottom, and he hit it. I was waiting for that dolphin to go away, so he may have to go back. Let's just check him anyway. I like to check these guys. Man, look at it, see those blue colors? I always like that. Look at that. And you see that little, like, uh, dark stripe? Look at him, oh, he almost got my finger. <laughs> Come on, guy. Come on, there you go. Yeah, let's get this check it stick out. I really like this check it stick. They got, they got some other ones out too. Watch, I'll put them down and he'll be. Look at that. Yeah, yeah, he's le he's legal. Look at him. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I want a bigger one though. <laughs> put a fresh green back on here, and um, right here, let's hook that guy. These these they're so small yet they're really fragile. Look at that. So, uh, and um, then I'm gonna throw some more chum out here. Right there, grab some more chum, just like this, and, and just flick it right out there, just like that. Let it sink down a little bit. 
See that green back? Look at them. Look at that. Very nice. That's the bait. Very easy. Very simple. And a little bit breezy out, and I'm going to flick them right out there. Now, if this tide was going in, uh, it, it'd be just perfect, and, and it should have switched already. It's hard to tell with the wind. So let's just see here. Let that go down. That chum gets these guys active. We'll get the grouper active too. Yesterday I hooked into that tarp and I hooked that and over the other side though. Here's a nice snapper here. Here's a nice, oh the dolphin got it. No it, he, he, he. ah dolphin got it, dang it. <laughs> he just, he sailed in. This guy just sailed right in here. <laughs> I, I, I just picked them right up. Now here's a nice mangrove. I reeled him in. Whoa! <laughs> He's jumping out of my hands. Anyways, I, I got him. I reeled him in and he just flew out of the water. And uh, right from here, because this dolphin's been hanging around here. But uh, look at that. See, you got him on that jig right there. That's all it takes with a little greenback. Nice looking fish, but uh, I want some bigger ones. I know I, I lost a big one, I had a hit. Man, he hit hard, but uh, once all the other boats get out here, we'll distribute them dolphins around here and uh, start getting in some bigger ones, but uh, beautiful fish. Another nice mangrove here, gotta get him up, gotta get him up quick. Oh, jeez, look at the size of that guy. That's a nice mangrove right there. That, that's, oh, that's what we're looking for, come on, guy. That's what we're looking for right there. That's it. Look at that, right on that jig. See that? Look at that guy. That's what we're looking for. That's what we're looking for. Mangroves just like that. This is what we're looking for. Oh, geez. He's on the hook. Don't worry. But, but uh, that's what we're looking for. Mangroves, mangroves just like this. Just like this. That's what we're looking for. That's what we want. That's what we. That's what we come out here for. Man, he's really active. But uh, let me just hold him up good here. But that. Here we go. Now we got him. I like to get the uh, the hook so you can see the hook set in him. But um, just like that. That's what we're looking for. Mangroves. Just like this. Man, look at this guy. I, I always admire these mangroves, and, and you know, I had them for dinner last night after I got done fishing. I come home and guess what my wife's cooking? Mangroves. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, look at that guy. Look at that. <laughs> nice looking fish. Well, let's catch another. This is my third mangrove. Mangrove, here's another one. Holy cow. Man, I tell you. Oh, come on, guy. Yeah, he's only a small one, but uh, you know, fun to catch. I want some bigger ones though. He's got to go back. Um, yeah, he's a little small guy. Let's let's get a bigger one. Go on. <laughs> got to get him in before the dolphin comes. Look at this guy. Look at the size of this guy. Holy cow! Whoa! He just got off. He just look at that guy right there. Whoa! And he just and he just got off the hook as I got him in the boat. Very nice. Whoa, look at that. Oh, here's, I gotta hold this guy. I just got this guy right here. And he just got in the boat, but you can you can see his mouth is all uh, all tore up here. I'm trying to hold him to keep him from jumping out, but uh, man, beautiful, look at that, man. Nice mangrove. I tell you, it's, the tide is really starting to rip right now, but, uh, and I dropped that uh, jig down right in front of the bollard right there let it just sink straight down and it doesn't take long give it slack and they just tear right at it nice man man look at that let's get another another man grow oh geez i tell you what <laughs> yeah these guys are tricky to catch today i tell you with this tide so strong man yeah look at that he's not bad he's probably 11 inches let's just see with the check and stick yep yeah, I'm right, 11 inches. Not a bad mangrove, I tell you. I want to get some bigger ones though, so I'm gonna to toss him back. He's gotta go, but uh, look at that. Nice, look at that. See how he's hooked with that? Look at that, that, that little jig right there, eighth ounce jig head, and um, boy, I've been, I've been just uh, casting out here, 
and the uh, the tide is really ripping so I cast it out here and let it sink until it gets right in this area this is where they're slamming it man but you can see it really ripping here this tide so you have the tide ripping in and the wind blowing this way so it's kind of a challenge but anyways this is what it produces right there just gotta you just gotta figure it out and, uh, then you can get them it's too wavy to go out into the channel today so but I'm having a good time here let's get another well I just changed the water in here the best I could and now um, I'm gonna add some foam off in there that's all you need right there Oh, I really like this foam off I mean uh, that works really good really keeps them healthy and um, I'm just using these aerators here that that's all I use right here just for uh, four aerators really works well look at that what I did is I just I just threw it out there on the calm because it's really ripping in here and just letting it slowly sink down to the bottom I need to get it where the mangroves are right here just right here and this is where I've been getting them right here see it how it going it's going straight down like that so I'm just gonna let some more they're right down in here oh look at that look at that man I tell you that's a beautiful snapper right there <laughs> These guys are tricky to get, especially with this current phone look at, like that. Man, look at how orange he is. But look at that. See how he's hooked on that jig? Man, that's a nice snapper. He's a good 12 incher too. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful snapper. Man, I tell you. Love these guys. Love catching these guys. But this this tide is really ripping. I mean, I mean really ripping out, but look at that. What a beautiful snapper. Man. Good eating. Look at these fat. Look at how look how look how fat he is. Holy cow, man! Man, oh man, really enjoy these guys. Look at that 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 jig right there. I tell you what, it's working miracles. Look at them. <laughs> man, let's get another. Come on, let go, let go, let go. You gotta watch your whoa. He's he's biting here again. Let's let's get a measurement on this guy and see exactly how big he really is. Let's see if he don't jump out of the boat. So <laughs> he's really active. Look at that. But yep, 12, 12 inches, a little over, a little over 12 inches. Man, what a beautiful fish. Man, I've been throwing a couple of these guys back, but I may keep this guy. He's pretty fat. So let's get another. Well, what I've been doing, the, the tide is coming in like this. And, um, you can see it ripping, ripping right through here, and I've been casting right in this little calm area like that right there, just letting it sink, just letting it sink straight down. Got to get it into the water column, just like that, letting it go slack. And by the time it gets over to here, that's where they hit, just at a certain, certain level. So we'll just see if we can repeat that again here. Let's see if we can repeat that. Yep, look at that guy, look at that guy, holy shit. <laughs> he got off right at the surface. Man, he was a nice mangrove. Well, let's get another. Let's try for another. A snapper here, I'm pretty sure of it. Holy cow, look at that big guy. Holy smoly. That's a big snapper right there. That's what we're after right there. Look at that guy. I had to move away from the dolphins. I <laughs> come in here. Uh, underneath the bridge I said I wonder if there's anything here and there you go I haven't even been here five minutes look what I got holy smolies let's get a measure on him <laughs> look at that got him on that uh, on that yellowtail jig look at that beautiful fish come on let's see what we got wow he's 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 15 inches that's a nice looking fish right right there he touched the tip of that and his nose is there so that's 15 inches. Beautiful fish, man. Man, I really admire these snappers. Look at how, look at, <laughs> look at his fins go up. You just touch him, look at him go up. Even these, look at that guy. <laughs> nice looking fish, man. Now here's what we come out here for. A head growth snapper like this, 15 inches long. Beautiful fish, man. Look at that guy. That's what we like right there. Head growth snapper, man. Just look at, him, look at him, look how fat he is right there. Yeah. Look at, see what he's going after? Oh, he's going, he's going after those little, uh, those little uh, yellow, uh, yellow tail jigs with uh, small, um, small greenbacks. I went out and caught some more, but uh, man, he's a big fat guy. Man, oh man, 
I'm gonna try for some more. This is what we come out here for. Love catching these guys. Man. Well, it looks like we had another great day out here on Tampa Bay mangrove snapper fishing. Uh, didn't get any tarpon, but we got a lot of mangroves. A lot, let a lot go, and here's what we ended up with right here. Nice 15 incher. He's about a 14 and a half, some 13s and a 12. Very nice. Look at this. Look at the size of this guy. I mean, and I lost one right near the boat that was even bigger than this, and the dolphin probably got just as many as these. <laughs> but that that's a good day of fishing right there on Tampa Bay. Right out here, right by the bollards. I, I moved down here and I got that, that one 15 incher right here. And uh, I was moving all around these bollards here because there were so many dolphin, but uh, had a really good day today. Used the, uh, the yellowtail snapper jig and uh, with greenbacks and got everything on that. Got everything on that. What, what a great, what a great rig. Just free lined it and let it take it and set that. And I was letting a lot go too. <laughs> I wanted the bigger ones. I'd let the littler ones go. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed the show. We had a great day on Tampa Bay, as, as usual. But, you know, some days you get nothing. But it's still fun to be out on the on the, uh, on the the bay here. Lots of people out here. I don't know what the ramp's going to be like when I get back. Probably crowded. But, uh, anyways, I hope you enjoyed the show. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up for a like and hit the subscribe button. Until then, this is Scott with Saltwater Fishing Tampa. Happy fishing.